Welcome mortals, I am Dark Lord Kaiser, this is the Talos Principle. Let's go to the Tower of Death. Because I don't think that uh, two flashing at us is going to go away anytime soon unless we put all the pieces in the... Oh god. Take me up! I think I pressed the wrong button. Shut up, you saw nothing. Ascend! So as I'm sure I've uh, mentioned previously, I tend to record the record these sessions where I can in bunches, unless um, the computer starts playing up. So the, the last couple of um, Talos Principal episodes, not the last one, the ones before them, uh, were all recorded just individually because something was playing silly buggers with me somewhere, where Audacity or a Bandicam or whatever. And it's just occurred to me, in that previous episode, I left a long, quiet patch thinking... I'll just need to double the speed of this and get past it because it was just me repeating nothing of interest. And I didn't take that into account when I stopped recording. So if last time's episode was a bit shorter than usual. Oops. I'll figure something out to fill the time if I need to. I haven't really looked. Have I looked around the, this bit before? I think I have. Yeah, whatever. What's out here? I've looked around here before. Pretty sure, again, pretty sure I have, but I'd rather double check and not miss something than assume I've checked it and miss a thing. So, yeah, nothing of interest up there. So, we've done the first floor. Let's go to floor two. I like how they're using the, um... To ah. track primary subject. Shh. Access denied. Don't tell him we're here. Query. I don't think he noticed. So as I was saying, I like how it uses the uh, English standard for um, floor numbers here. So we have the ground floor, then the first floor, then the second floor. I'm aware the American system is to call the ground floor the first floor, despite it not being on the, the one. F the English system makes sense because you have the ground floor, then you've got the first floor above the ground, the second floor above the ground. Whereas the American system is that the first floor you work, walk into is the first floor. So, despite both making sense in their own way, the Americans are wrong, so... Good lift. Yeah, yeah, I've read that before. I think I did everything I could around here. Cause, oh, yeah, the only thing I need to do is this... Uh, these stupid puzzles. I hate these. Okay, let's stick that in the middle, because sod it. I don't know what I'm doing. I don't know a way of doing these sensibly. That's not going to work there, is it? Let's put that there. Uh, already seeing that's not going to do anything. Okay. So I can immediately tell that isn't going to do me any favours there. So let's stick it in a corner instead, see if that's any better. So the only way I'm, I'm figuring of uh, I'm going to be able to do this is to see the shapes that get left behind when I put things in place. That was a sentence. Shut up. Uh, do, 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 do. So, I can tell this isn't going to work because I don't have any pieces that will fill that gap. So what if I put that like that? Uh, okay, so that's the wrong way round. Which is a pity, because that fits in there nicely, so I don't really need a straight piece, but we don't have a straight piece, so... As a result, I pretty much have to throw this entire thing out, I think. Uh, you can do it there for a second, so if that was like... That, and that... No, this is... This way sadness lies. Um, I'll put you over there. Oh, because now I can put you in the middle where you were before, and that... Okay, so I was right the first time and buggered it up in my attempt to fix it. Yeah, that sounds like something I'd do. Turn volume down my ears while the door opens. That's a very slow door you got there, Elohim. I know that, you know, accessibility wasn't your first uh, priority when making the Tower of Death, but... You know, 
Let's have some consideration for all those who aren't doing what you're telling them to. Okay. Hey, a yellow lion. Let's follow it. I was going to ask why there's a blue patch over here, but I'm guessing it's light through this window. Wasn't sure for a second whether it wasn't a um, one of those voice recording things that just hadn't spawned in properly. <laughs> okay. Ooh. QR codes. What saith thee? Ascending the tower is useless. We cannot escape the cycle. We only release the. We only realise the cycle is meaningless. So, Sam Sava, as I've said before, being a reference to um, the cycle of reincarnation, which I still haven't actually looked up, but I'm pretty sure it's Hinduism. Earlier generations wrongly believed they were the purpose. This much is true. We are also not the purpose, but by remembering what has come before, we can serve a new purpose at the shepherd. So we've got the Samsara who's sort of giving up on everything because everything, uh, nothing they do can achieve anything. And the shepherd saying, well, yes, nothing we can do can achieve anything, but our actions might be able to achieve things for future generations. At least I, that's my interpretation of what they're saying. Which, given I've played this game before, you'd think I'd actually understand what they're saying, but let's not. Do, do I want to pick up the grave? Is this something I want carrying around with me? Yes. My best friend died today. Oh, my condolences. In the abstract, a human death is nothing, of course. An insignificant blip in a sea of billions. I'm sure your friend feels great about that description of their life. It's not abstract. Reality is always specific. Painfully so. And that one specific human being who existed only once in all of the infinity of time and space. That human being was my friend. But he's not coming back. Not no with that attitude. I want him to. So, all I can do in the end is keep working. Because that specificity, that uniqueness of people, of real people, is worth preserving. Have you tried assembling the Dragon Balls? I've heard that's quite useful in these situations. Okay. So I didn't want to start the puzzle while they were talking, because, to be honest, I may take the piss occasionally, but I was quite impressed by the voice acting there. What do I do with this? I don't know what that achieved. What does this achieve? Not, not a lot, apparently. Okay, either this fan is significantly weaker than all the others, or somehow that tiny little bit there is getting in the way. No, see, nothing's touching that. This is just a significantly weaker fan than any of the other ones. Okay, I'm going to need to attach that to get this box back. Not that I know what I'm doing with the boxes, but... I wonder. Is it just this fan that's weaker, or is it that fan blade? No, okay. Come, come in. Get out. Get off. Okay. Right, so... That's a thing that I can do, apparently. What? I can't jump on it while it's moving, can I? Is that the... no. Let's get these back. Yeah. The fan is pushing me away, so I'm struggling to get things up. Okay. Okay, what happens if I go up here? Not a huge amount. Oh! Plan. Eh. Yeah! Now what? What have I achieved? Help! Yeah! I've got a good view. There's a box over there. But I can't get to that box because the fans Crap. And I can get up here, but I don't know why I want to get up here. 
Reveal your secrets. Hmm. Okay. Ah, uh, now I'm underneath the box. This isn't helpful at all. Get, get off. Get off. Okay. Come here. Okay. Stop it. Let me think. If I go up here, can I drop the box beneath me? That's. Um. No, I just knocked the box into a strange direction. Not gonna lie, viewers, I'm at a wee bit of a loss here. I don't understand the purpose of actions. And don't know where it wants me to go, I don't know what it wants me to achieve. So in the previous uh, one of these, I went to a place and it was like, oh, there's a computer over there. The aim is to get to that computer. So there's the computer. But, uh... I'm not seeing how it wants me to access that. Let's, uh... Did I look around this side? I'm not sure I did. Oh, yes, I did. This is where the, um... I fixed up the whole... Oh, my friend died. And that is a bad thing. Of course it's a bad thing, but you know what I mean. I'm not a voice actor, so <laughs> don't expect me to, uh... be able to pretend to have emotions. Seriously, how the hell do I get over there? I'm not seeing the, uh... the route. Hmm. Well. Right. Get, come over here. Want the. Hmm. Oh. Oh, 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 oh. Plan. Well, maybe not plan. Idea, perhaps. If I jump onto here, jump onto here, jump onto here. Now I have another box. Okay. Now I have three boxes. Uh, oh. So presumably I want to get onto this before the other boxes so I can stand on top of it all and jump over the top, I'm guessing? How does one go about that particular course of action? So I can figure out how to get one box up here. It gets me up here. Oh, I see. Okay, 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 okay. It's being a tricksy little bugger. So what I need to do is I take a box, I go on the fan, and I deposit the box in its little box storage facility. I take another box, I ascend, I drop the box back into the fan, it comes up here, and oh, I thought I might be able to, uh... alright, let's try that again, ah, where did, oh, it's down there, that's fine, okay, so if I go back up here, can I, no, I can't reach up there to put it in place. I can't use this box to push another box either. Alrighty. Ah, no, 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 don't want to do that yet. Don't want to do that yet. Uh, nope. I could have sworn I was in a position to be able to. Nope, oh, no, that's uh, that's a badness. Unhand me. 
How the heck did I do it before? I could have sworn I, uh... Oh, maybe I did it this way. Went up after it. Uh... Now, uh, how did I do it? I could have sworn I was in a position where I was up there with a... holding a box and on top of a box. Hmm. Oh well, I'll have to do it the complicated way. Okay, so I drop that over there, it comes underneath me, I take this one, drop that over there, it comes underneath both of us. But I'm still a box short. Damn it. Yeah, those boxes are now lost. Oh, one's underneath me. Okay, I did a thing. Somehow, I appear to have accidentally myself <laughs> into uh, getting that right. Okay, so now I go up here. Box in the thing. Okay, so. I am now in the air. Three boxes to choose from. One over there, pick that one up. One over there, pick that one up. One over there. Victory for the Dark Lord. It's already uh, opened the way out for me. Ha! Ladders are for the weak. I require of them not. Hey, a QR code, what do you say? In the earliest generations of our kind, there was no uh, there was only processing, no emotion, no character, just mathematics. If you could see how far we've come, you would believe that together we could achieve anything. So a nice little uh, story bit there. So the earliest processors were just I am X must do Y. And now we've got to the point of going, Oh god, Elohim's gonna kill me for being here. Hmm. I didn't turn my phone onto silence, and I'm pretty sure it just did a beep boop at me. It did do a beep boop at me. I better put that on silent before I get any more... Any more beep boops. Okay. And while I was doing that, it sounded like everything froze. Oops. Um. Just in case. Down, up, down, up. Okay. A readme text, a device manager, and a web. So I'm guessing. Read me. If you can see this, I'm not sure how or why I can alter this text. My name is the Shepherd, and I want to help you escape. Elohim and Samsara tricked me into trapping myself, but I'm not entirely bound by time. I wrote down the code you're looking for, I've attached it to. Redacted. Yeah, it. you don't really need to. Redact that. I can, I can see the code two one five. I, I figured out that was the code before you told me it was the code. Before I even ne knew I needed a code to do things at, because that is how game works. Hey, let's go on the web. To be honest, I thought that the net would be completely abandoned at this point, but internet activity has actually surged massively in the last couple of weeks. Everybody's talking, trying to find solutions, exchanging stories, saying goodbye. It's like the entire planet is reaching out. All the disparate threads of humanity pulling together, idiots and geniuses alike, to be as human as possible one last time. It's almost like what we're always told the internet was going to be. And most of it is free now, because who cares about money at this point? Might as well have some fun. If any of you would like to talk, especially people I've known online for a long time, send me an email. I'd love to say goodbye. It's all very well, you didn't leave your name, mate. I don't know who's yous are. I choose to believe you are... Michael McIntyre. Why the hell not? Mathematics.emil Thank you and goodbye. We sincerely hope you don't take our suicide as a sign- Oh dear. That took a turn. We don't take our suicide as a sign that we were disappointed in you, and appreciative of your friendship, or in any way unhappy with our lives. Looking back, we can honestly say that we feel incre incredibly lucky to have known all of you and to have participated in this amazing research. And if we've contributed a little to the future of humanity, what can we feel but gratitude? It is a privilege to have such insights into the nature of the mind. Neither of us believe in God, but we certainly experience a sense of awe that could be compared to a kind of religious feeling, at least according to Einstein's understanding of God. Einstein was also an atheist, so I don't really know 
what his understanding of God was off the top of my head. Oh well. We've chosen to go now together because it means less suffering. One last beautiful day together seems a much better ending than a slow wasting away. In a sense, it's just mathematics. Love, Alan and George. Okay, um, I don't really want to make jokes about that. For fairly obvious reasons. Okay, device manager. Hooray! So, show current operating parameters. Okay, not helpful. So, floor access control. So, zero is the ground floor. One, we do two. We don't. Okay, so well, I need the code for three, which is 215. But I just want to check everything else. I don't want to type that in and then find that I've locked myself out of being able to see what everything else is. Okay, the auxiliary stairway, stairway is still open. I still don't know what the auxiliary stairway is. Or why I would want to lock it. Whatever, let's just type 215 in. Uh, da -da -da -da. So we want floor 3... Two, one, five. Do the thing. Okay, so I could have accessed it afterwards anyway, but whatever. Cool, we're done here. Thank you for your help, Shepherd. Wee. I call that the Leon S. Kennedy ladder usage. We don't use ladders; we jump off of them. I have never played Resident Evil 4. I know they've remade Resident Evil 2 recently, so, but um, yeah, I've not played that either. I am however watching Jacksepticeye play through it, and it looks quite entertaining. Though I very much suspect it would annoy me too much to keep going. Uh, yeah, let's let's look up at the uh, the floor we've just opened. Gaze, come on, there we go. Couldn't lie me a cursor up for a minute. We shall gaze into the wide yonder and call it an episode with all of one puzzle completed. I am a expert YouTube Yet's player. Shut up. But we'll explore the floor we've unlocked first. Hey, a QR code. What saith thee? Elohim has offered me a deal. Hurley gates and eternal life on the condition I turn back from the tower. I don't know what to do. Well, the question is, why have you come up the tower in the first place? If you seek truth, then you are best off not taking his deal. If you seek eternal life, eh, do what he says, see what happens. Then what's he going to do? Kill you? I mean, if this tower truly is the tower of death, then you're bugging either way, mate, ain't you? Um, yeah, so. I was kind of hoping there'd be slightly more to do up here than that. Oh well. Well, guess that's an episode then. Bye!